the mustard's going in the jar. You cannot come to Merrickville without visiting Mrs. McGarrigal's. And Janet Campbell is behind Mrs. McGarrigal's. And this is the label. This is a label. You're going to see, what, 300 retail outlets? Yes, across just over 300 now. Yes. All the mustards and the condiments, which you started making in a tiny little kitchen. I did, I did. I started actually at the uh, what used to be the city jail in Ottawa, so down at uh, Arts Court now. The hostel, the yeah. Yeah, oh. yeah, the hostel kitchen. Very but, cool. Yes, and now we're producing about 200,000 jars a year here, oh. all by hand. And, and still filling each jar, oh, labeling each we're one. Very low, tech. we're very low tech. <laughs> and repeat, you said all day yeah. long. That's what yes. you do. Yes, blend, pour, cap, uh, label, repeat. But they <laughs> have been, well, and you do cooking classes in here as well, which are very big now. We do, mm -hmm. we do. Uh, we just have our new schedule out uh, this week, actually. So we have different guest chefs that come every week, uh, different themes, uh, everything from Christmas in, in an hour, doing yeah. the whole Christmas menu in an hour, um, to Vietnamese, um, you know, all, all types of cooking, um, wheat-free, uh, nice. dining. And, and guest chefs coming in to head those up. Exactly, yeah. exactly. A uh, different cool. theme every week, so it's a lot of fun. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the shop and see all the different products. So there's a look at some of the cooking classes coming up here at Mrs. McGarrigal's, the beautiful storefront here. And you're going to find all kinds of fantastic products and gift ideas and anything you need for entertaining, really, right? Exactly, exactly. Everything from um, things that are made locally, a lot of um, sauces and uh, preserves, uh, and also a lot that we import as well, hard to find products from uh, from Europe, from a lot of specialties right. from uh, England. The taste of home that people exactly. just are in search of. Ex exactly. Yeah. So this is kind of your graduation <laughs> of, you know, the mustard that this you began with and all the different flavors. Exactly. Yeah. We're, we're up to uh, 13 flavors now. Wow. Um, we're working on our uh, creamy herb Dijon as well. That'll be our 14th flavor. Wow. Um, so yeah. Now, How do you recommend using some of these? Um, Definitely, the, our newest one is the cranberry port mustard. Um, this is gorgeous in that we use uh, fresh cranberries in it um, and fresh lemons. Uh, it's great on a pork tenderloin, for example, mm. just slathered on uh, in a, a vinaigrette as well. It's really good. Okay. Um, chipotle lime is probably still my favorite. I think I got this one last time I was here. That's, that was really good. I think good. so, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's got a nice smoky flavor and then the citrus kind of cuts the heat a little bit. So this one I use on anything grilled. It's yeah. really good um, that way. Um, the balsamic cracked pepper, uh, mm. it's got a real bite to it. Lots and lots of cracked pepper we stand over the pot for quite a while. <laughs> Great. Okay. Yeah. And I believe that you do that by yeah. hand for that we long. We do, we do. Um, How do you eat that one? That one is really nice. With uh, with red meat, especially mm, with the balsamic, yeah. and then the nice pepper, or the heat of the pepper. Um, I make um, a nice strip loin steak with uh, a brandied mustard sauce, and I use that one in oh, that. Yummy. So it's really good that Creamy way. Champagne. Creamy champagne. Champagne. That um, I came up with that definitely as an alternative to a typical Dijon mustard. So okay. anywhere you would use a Dijon in in a vinaigrette, in a sauce, it's wonderful. So if people um, go to your website and get recipes, get ideas. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's um, mustard.ca. So mustard. keep it simple. simple. Keep, it, keep it simple. And the cooking classes will be listed there. Cooking classes are on, all online, and uh, we also have lots of demos from local producers come in and uh, taste their wares in the kitchen when we're not in production. So you do a fantastic job, and your Thank mustard you. has come a long way, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Mrs. McGarrigal's here in Merrickville. Another must do.